Wright School was founded in 1865 as one of the pioneer schools in Sonoma County. It was built on land donated by Winfield S. M. Wright, husband of Sarah Boone, granddaughter of frontiersman Daniel Boone. Wright was one of the richest men in Sonoma County and served as a state assemblyman. In 1946, after increased enrollment, only one class remained at Wright School while all the other classes took over vacated barracks on the nearby Naval Air Station. A few years later in 1948, all classes were held at the Naval Air Station and teachers were faced with competing against the noise of jet aircraft. In 1951, the present Wright School at 4389 Price Avenue was opened. In 1954, the old site was set up to support the first class for severely retarded children north of San Francisco and was renamed the Stephen Irwin School. On February 6, 1968, the old school and site was bid on and sold. Wright's educational mission is based on three cornerstones to develop the well-rounded student. Academics, character, and creativity. As a charter school, we accept only students that meet and achieve our strict academic standards. Project-based learning involves educational academic research combined with student-developed and produced integrated projects. We believe that integrating technology into the classroom is essential to modern learning. This is why we have invested significantly into technology infrastructure, such as high-speed internet access, wireless access to every classroom, and mobile computer labs. Wright Charter has invested heavily in the installation of interactive whiteboards, and every classroom is equipped with projectors, computers, and document cameras. We have trained teachers to use this technology to create engaging lessons that allow students to interact with the information directly. Opportunities for many academic competitions exist at Wright Charter School. One such opportunity is our chess program, which is open to all students, whether they're beginners or advanced players. Each year there is a school tournament, and the champions play in the district tournament. The science fair is a national competition that is a one-time requirement for 7th or 8th grade students. The competition is based on specific scientific topics studied in science class. The students participate in a school competition with winners moving on to the county. Winners of the county move on to the state contest, and state winners continue to the national level. In the past, as many as five county winners have moved on to the state competition. History Day is a national competition designed to engage students in historical research and to create a project-based presentation through various creative media. Projects are judged based on quality of research as well as the quality of the presentation. Students participate in a school-level competition. The top projects are then selected to compete at the county level. Winners of the county competition can then participate at the state level. Finalists are selected and proceed to the nationals. Wright Charter School has had its History Day successes. It has had as many as 30 county participants in grades 4th through 8th, and 8 state participants and 1 state finalist. Odyssey of the Mind is a world competition that teaches creativity through problem solving. Students select one problem from a list and must solve the problem using teamwork but without outside assistance. Students begin by participating in a regional competition. Winners move on to a state contest and those state winners continue to the world competition. Part of character development takes place through eco-literacy, which educates our students on the natural environments that make life on Earth possible. Through this understanding, kids learn the principles of creating sustainability in their community. We at Wright Charter do this in two different ways. Wright Charter has multiple interactive eco-sites throughout the campus. Wright Charter provides opportunities for our 7th and 8th graders to participate in off-site walks of approximately 8, 12, 15, and 20 miles. These walks are designed to increase local environmental awareness as well as engaging the students in physical exercise. Every walk has an additional purpose which can be historical, mathematical, scientific, or language arts related. The mission for these walks is to build character and more step by step. 
7th and 8th grade students are required to participate in service learning activities. Students are required to volunteer a minimum of 25 hours per year. This allows students to give back and to find their own place in their local communities through their time and effort. We believe that athletics provides the perfect environment for students to develop character in the areas of teamwork, cooperation, and hard work. Wright Charter has a strong athletic program for 4th through 8th grade boys and girls teams. The third cornerstone at Wright Charter School in developing the well-rounded student is creativity. Wright Charter is one of the few schools to maintain a strong music program, which includes a beginning and advanced band and a choir. Instruments are taught through group lessons and music is taught in the classroom environment. Guitar Club allows students to learn to play and perform acoustic guitar. Art is an integral part of the classroom education environment. It is commonly used to enhance the core curriculum and reinforces instruction through interaction. Wright Charter's belief is that drama should be and is an integral part of our students' education. Early drama involvement helps students develop cooperative and teamwork skills as well as discipline and attentiveness. Throughout the year, students are given many opportunities to engage in academic expression. Creativity is combined with academics allowing students to choose different creative media including exhibits, two-dimensional displays, video or presentation documentaries, dramatic performances, and website design, communicating academic research and student-achieved knowledge. These cornerstones of education help to develop well-rounded students at Wright Charter. As we march into the future with technology and modernization projects, we will never forget the founding roots of the Wright School District. A pioneering spirit focused on the success of the students and preparing them to be well-rounded students for responsible living in the 21st century. We certainly are a small school with a big future.